vacation rentals. I'm in beautiful sunny Florida on an island off the coast of St. Augustine checking out some short-term rentals and I wanted to give a quick update or my thoughts on the changing landscape of short-term rentals or rentals in general and that's because of what Airbnb and Verbo, all of those short-term platforms are causing changes between not only HOAs, counties, cities, any type of jurisdiction. So you used to be able to just check and see if it was a short-term availability. The short-term has also changed. What that means, is it one week? Is it 30 days? Is it, is it three months? The landscape is changing, so we have to do a little bit more homework than we used to do. And I actually just turned down an opportunity in Georgia in a new construction development because if I wanted to rent and not even do short-term, I couldn't do short-term there, they wanted me to pay $20,000 just so I could have the option to rent if I wanted to, which at that point, it's almost a deal breaker because it's too, it was a new community and it was subjective. 